We're here today at Dublin High School Wind Shape Camps going on all week. What a great time for kids this week. If your kids don't have anything to do this week, we've got something for them to do. We're going to be talking to the camp directors, the pastors, some of the volunteers here, but it's going on all week here at Dublin High School. So many activities. You're going to be watching for the next few minutes. These kids having a really great time. Get your kids out here. There's financial funding. If you don't have the money for it, nobody's being turned away. Don't worry about that. But what a great week to bring your kids out here to Dublin High School. Stay with us. We've got more to come. We're going to be talking to a lot of the volunteers, camp directors, and let you know what your kids can be exposed to this week right here in Dublin. One of the things that I'd like to do is express our thanks to the Dublin City Schools and Dublin High School. They have been phenomenal in, in, in providing facility for wind-shaped camps, for, this, for our community to come together and for our kids to have a camp this week. They have been over backwards to make sure that accommodations are excellent here, from the superintendent's office to the principal's office to the coaches and the teachers and all the faculty here. We express a sincere thank you from the, the community of Dublin. As you can see behind me, we're playing a game that's very similar to Duck Duck Goose, but we use a noodle. And what they're doing is they're running around in circles, and it's called Tail in the Bait. And what they're trying to do is, we're anchored is our theme this summer, and we're trying to get that bait, and we're trying to catch it. And as you can see, there's a lot going on on the Connect Creation Field right now, and camp is happening this week here at Dublin High School from Monday through Friday from 7.45 to 5 and on Friday it's a half day and we invite the whole community to come out and eat some Chick-fil-A and check it out with us. The objective of this week, we want to teach the kids um, how to, our purpose we will find when deep friendship with God and others is yours and mine. Anchored is the theme and so we want them to be anchored on who Christ is and what Christ has to do. And so we want to connect the church and the community as one because the church is the community and so that is our goal. We want kids to have fun. Fun is the big element. As you can see, they're having fun all around here. We're having fun. I'm having fun. So if anybody's watching right now, you're welcome to come out. We'll have registration tomorrow, Wednesday, and Thursday. You can come whenever you want to. We recommend you come tomorrow so they don't miss the rest of the week, but we'd love to have your campers here at camp. So as you can see, she has a noodle, and, and he's explaining. Logan, our leader, is explaining. She just put the noodle under him, and he just caught her. And so now she is out. Or she's it. And Where are y'all from? Uh, we're from all over the U.S. There are some of us that are from California, some Mississippi, some Louisiana, Alabama, Georgia. We're from all over. <laughs> Summer of 2013, a group of us got together in, in the community and just and pitched an idea to the community to have a, a camp for kids. Uh, and what came out of it is Wind Shaped Camp. And so we shared that. And so from the very beginning, there's never, this has never been a one church or a one group camp. It's been a community camp that's happened here. So we have campers first completed first grade through sixth grade that have come apart. And so you've seen just a little bit of, of them, what's, what's taking place. But we have a number of churches that have supported us, that are a part of the leadership that have really backed this and, and taken it, and even more have jo joined in since then. And so we're already looking and planning for next year even more churches and community groups, businesses and organizations that have been involved to help support, to provide financial needs, scholarships. Any kid can come to this camp if they want to, if they want to, because the, the finances are provided because of loving people in this community that love the kids in our community and they have given financially to make sure that it's available for everyone that wants to be involved. Well, it's so important because with a kids camp like this, we pull together. One of the purposes, main purposes here is to instill faith in these students to provide 
a positive atmosphere for every one of these kids to come uh, to be loved on, to know that they have a community here that cares for them. Not only do we have 27 professional, professionally trained uh, staffers that have come in, but we have over 80 volunteers from right here in our community that have poured in, that are serving all week long. And so they have, have jumped in. One of the main goals of Windshape Camp as well is to, to bring in family. And on Friday we have what we call Chick-fil-A Friday Family Fun Day where all of the families of the campers are invited to come in to be a part of their skills, to be a part of the, the large group fun time and the worship time and their Bible study team times and, and their skills and everything. Come join in. See your kids being loved on. See your kids having a great time here and just enjoy it. Come and spend a little bit of time with your kids and have a fantastic time with them. If you have a student that has completed first grade through completed sixth grade and you would love for your child to be a part of Windshape, we'd love for them to come out. There's a place for them. There's a way for them to be here. We've had many loving people in our community make sure that that's possible by giving financial scholarships and sponsorships. Many businesses in our community have given to make sure that your child could be able to come to Windshape and be a part of something this great. So any day this week, come join in, jump in. We'll get you signed up, registered, and then we're already, we already have campers looking forward to next year, and this is just the first day of camp. So come join us at Windshape. Take control of your future. Start a career in cosmetology today. Helen Powell, owner and instructor of Careers in Cosmetology, boasts a 100% pass rate for stylists. Careers in Cosmetology is a private school that teaches every student as an individual while providing a team-oriented environment. Earn your career fast and gain opportunity for advancement. Get started today. Call Helen Powell at 272-1967. Careers in Cosmetology, solid education since 1985. Uh, Windshape Camps for Communities is happening right here at Dublin High School uh, from 7.45 in the morning until 5 o'clock in the afternoon every day this week, Monday through Friday. Friday is just a half a day because we kick off with a Friday Family Fun Day. And uh, it will end at lunch having Chick-fil-A is providing lunch for all the families that come and participate. So all week long, you can come and be a part here at Windshake. Well, uh, the reason why I volunteer for this is just that I just like to get out with the kids and just, you know, hang out with them, play with them. I'm r literally a kid at heart. I love doing, uh, I do VBS every year and I love to get around them and any other camp I can, you know, volunteer with. I'll help out. I used to do impact and go with them. And just like having the kids out here having fun is just like what gets me going. It just puts that extra boost of energy in me whenever. I just see these kids. If I'm just tired, I see them go ahead and I'm just like, okay, great. I got to do this. I got this. I got this. But um, it's also great for our community to have camp here because I went to camp when I was little and a lot of people can't go to camp 
off. And so it's great that Winshade came here and is providing kids who can't go off a place here where they can actually experience, have that camp experience all day. And so it's just really fun. It's the first day. It's already been a blast. I mean, we're already probably like three hours into it, and it is awesome. I cannot wait to see what the rest of the week has to do has to deal with. So, I'm just ready for it. <laughs> yeah! Woo! What are y'all going to? Archery! Yeah! Fantastic. All right, Archer, you want to slow down? Like? Hey, you guys. Hey, Michaela. And so we've got a bunch of arrows over here. We got a bunch of bows. But bow and arrow does not a shooter make. It's going to be some games we're going to play. It's going to be competition. It's going to be practice all wrapped up into it. What's going to happen is that compression is towards the energy. All right, and that energy is going to On the arrow, we have the shaft. We have the fletching. Um, these are veins because they're plastic. If it was feathers, then we would call it fletching. That always sticks out, all right? And so depending on whether you're right-handed or left-handed, you're going to shoot a different way. Now, if you're right-handed, you're going to hold the bow with your left hand. And there's two different types of ways you can draw. Now, you can draw a Mediterranean style, which is... You know, ahead. All right, for a left-handed shooter, you're going to shoot on a different side of the bow. You're going to be holding it... the riser. Now on the riser you have this right here. What you don't want is for when you draw the arrow back, you do not want your finger right here to all the place and you're not going to hit the target. I'm out here volunteering because there's a lot of kids out here and they really enjoy shooting sports. And it's great to shoot, but to shoot with proper technique and to be able to shoot well is another thing entirely. And so making sure they know how to shoot and then can go out and apply those skills later on and shooting is a lot of fun, but when you can actually shoot well and you can shoot with other people, then it's a lot more fun. And so I believe it's it's a great opportunity um, to help a lot of people. And you know, even something small like showing somebody how to, to draw a bow back right or aim, I mean, it's going to save them a lot of frustration. And they're going to be able to use those skills later on. And who knows, may become the next Olympic uh, recurve champion. So this is actually just the first day uh, here at Dublin High School at the Windshape Camps. There's still, we've still got four more days of lots of fun, lots of games, fellowship uh, with other people. And so I encourage you all to come out, have fun, and uh, we'll see you out here on the range. When it comes to outdoor power equipment, tools, and accessories, around here there's only two names you need to know, Cullen Supply and Engine Service, and Still. Two trusted names in outdoor power tools, offering a wide range of blowers, trimmers, edgers, the right tool for any outdoor job. See the wide range of still power tools today at Cullen Supply and Engine Service, 910 East Jackson Street at the River Bridge in Dublin. So about the camp, first of all, it's wind-shaped camps, and it's about expanding the fellowship of community and getting kids, youth, and connected with God and Jesus and friendship. That's the whole point of this anchored system right, right here. This theme is anchored, and that's the whole purpose is to get deep friendship with God and others. And so that's this connected community and the churches together, and it's, you know, how we are disconnected and to just unite and together and bound. And um, how I got started with Windshape Camps, well, I was, just, I was just sitting, you know, I, I was just a college student, and I was just sitting down at the desk, and everybody was like, you know what, you, should, you are entitled to the youth ministry, you are together, you should probably go out and do wind-shaped camps, you'll be great. And I was like, ah, oh, okay, I'm, okay, I'll, I'll go try it. And I was there, and um, so I applied, and I was a little nervous, it's going to be my first year, and then I applied and liked my video. And so, and so at the end of the day, I was like, oh, this is going to be so awesome, I get to teach the youth. And I was like, okay, to span on this anchor theme of deep friendship with God and others. And that's, I was like so passionate because I, I like to be out there silly and crazy. And kids are just a great, great engagement for that. So, 
Well, for all the kids and youth out there who are interested in wind shape for camps, for communities, it's a great camp in which you can get engaged and act silly and have fun and also get to learn about Jesus Christ, your Lord and Savior. And that's exactly what we want y'all to be anchored in, deep friendship with God and others. And so, and so now that you guys are all welcome here at Windshade Camps for the Communities. We have all these amazing staff, all the campers who are already here, already excited and pumped up. And we know that you guys are going to have a great time as well. It's going to be amazing and have a blast. And that's going to do it for this newscast. We want to remind you one more time, it's not too late to sign up for camp. Be out here tomorrow at Dublin High School. Get your child involved. And also this Friday, it will be Family Day here at Dublin High School for all the camp participants and their families. All of it free of charge, brought to you by Chick-fil-A, David Roberts, and the fine staff over at Chick-fil-A on Veterans Boulevard. Make sure you get your child involved this week. Windshake Kids Camp at Dublin High School.